dumb, young, young, dumb and broke, young, dumb, young, young, dumb and broke. Hey, what is going on, guys? It's your boy Tucker, and in this video, I'm gonna be talking about the new update that was just dropped on Case Clicker yesterday, I think. Um, it added the perfect world sticker capsules. I'll show you those right now. Actually, I need to buy them first. Five hundred dollars. Jeez, they better be good. Capsules. Perfect world. Bought three of them, I think. And open capsules. So the this was to commemorate the dropping of CSGO in China. Um, it's called Perfect World over there. Um, or I think that was like the engine. That, I don't know why it's called Perfect World. But that's what it was commemorating. That's why these stickers are in the game. Because CSGO dropped in China and yeah. So the next thing that was really big um, People are really misunderstanding what this is. Added offer wall, also known as the marketplace. So it's under NetHub. It's right above promo code and under raffle. Enter. And here you are. You see all these offers on here. So what people think of when they hear market is when you go, like, they think of, like, another, like, game or site that you use your tickets or the value of your items on that site to withdraw items of that value with a some sort of percentage taken off for the site but this is just an offer wall so as you can see here these people have posted it's first their net hub name and then what they have and what they want so this guy uh, has a dragon lord and one knives so and then you just open up a trade and he has a dragon lord and you put in knives it's not um that good in my opinion um so these so then it goes back to trades and then you have to go back in the market so here's my problem so it has these offers, right? So and then it can trade with them. I wish it was real time trading, right? There's no notification that pops up when you have a trade offer. There's no um, like way to like message or there's no notification if they message you. And I think it just needs to be someone posts a trade they put their items in and then so if it's not going to be real time someone puts their items in and then you click you the items already there and you just put whatever you need in there I don't think it should just move to another trade like that that's just my opinion um, but yeah so see this guy knife ruby doppler stat track factory new and 52k scans okay so that that's what he has and then this and then you can put in whatever you whatever he wants um, I know people are really upset because they thought the market was going to be something completely different from this this is just an offer wall so you don't have to go on to the discord and find a trade or reddit and find a trade or the Facebook and find a trade just use this but I don't know how effective this will be I think it needs some tweaking I'll just add an offer right now what items are you offering? Free monies. What do you want in return? Subs for YouTube. And create offer. And there we are, boys. We're on there. Number one. So again, just so we're not everyone's upset. I know you guys want it to be so you can just use your tickets in the casino and withdraw skins that way or use your money and buy skins that way. It's just not going to happen. Krypton doesn't want that because it's so easy to get money. See, in those other games that that's a thing, there's one game in particular that I'm thinking of 
So you, you open cases only. You can't get money over here by tapping. You only open cases. Then the, skin, the little skins you have go into the casino. And then from the casino, you can withdraw whatever skins you want. But you have to have the skins in the first place. And then the luck in the casino to eventually get to where you are with withdrawing whatever you want. So... That makes sense in those games. In this game, it just does not make sense to add a marketplace that you can buy whatever skins you want with a specific amount or type of currency. So that's basically the update. Um, I know people are really excited about it and kind of let down. I know it needs some tweaking. I will talk to Krypton about it and hopefully it gets better in the future. And yeah, guys, that will be the video. There's also some bug fixes, but not really that um, exciting, I guess. Update was kind of beat. He is working on the alpha for the Tap the Monster. If you guys are on the Reddit, you will have seen something about that. It's a different RPG kind of game. Alpha will be out soon. I'll let you know if anyone wants to get in about it in the future. And yeah, guys, that'll be it. Make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you already haven't. Um, and leave a comment down below what you want to see and what you thought about the video. This has been your boy Tucker, and peace.